Good morning, Anita and T. People who arrived here at O'Hare last night knew that they are the lucky ones to have escaped this disaster in Maui. A raging wildfire would be terrifying anywhere, but imagine if you're on vacation and you don't even know your surroundings that well. That's what they faced, especially given one uh, tourist journey they described down a narrow, winding back road in flames. So some of them shared cell phone video and pictures showing scenes from their harrowing escapes. One tourist captured daylight pictures of the smoke from his hotel balcony, but describes a much more ominous scene later. Especially at nighttime when it's dark, you can see the fire very clearly. In the daytime, you see a lot of smoke, but at night you see the, the orange glow of the, and you see how massive the fire is. And we'll be there for weeks and months ahead to help them uh, recover whatever the need is that uh, we're going to be there to support now that was paul bamman he is from frankfurt illinois he's with the american red cross and he's one of about 200 people heading to maui to offer assistance he will be flying out of o'hare this morning to offer his help back to you in the studio all right roseanne thank you